Can I borrow your vehicle? Take your iPod! Here's a bit parts. I want to bring the reality of TV. Okay. Okay, yet problem. Thanks a lot. I told you I'm not gonna go. I'm your brother. I'm supposed to take care of my family. Hey! I'm beyond being taken care of now. Hey! 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 Your brother said you needed a hand. <laughs> Looks like you'll need more than that. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Oh. <sighs> hey! Ah! Wake up, you fucking junkie! I'm awake. I was just wishing you'd leave. Hey. Hey. Sit down. <clears throat> That's pretty good gear. I'm pretty high. Good for you. Okay. Don't get sanctimonious on me. Okay. Why do you do this to yourself? Because it feels nice. <clears throat> because it feels better to be high than not. Does it stop you thinking? <coughs> it stops you caring. Which is even better. <coughs> so. What do you care about? I care about getting people back who claimed I was a grass. People who use that to steal shit off me. Huh. Maybe that's what your brother was talking about. When they said you needed help taking care of all the business. Sure. I mean... I ain't a saint. I ain't a man of principle. I... I messed up. But... I tried. I made a mistake! But I admitted it. We all make mistakes. Exactly! And this guy is STILL threatening to kill me and my family! What's his name? Uh, uh. Bucky Sligo. Bucky Sligo. I heard he was living in Alderney. Can you get access to police computer? Sure. Find the fuck. Shut him. It is pals up. Ugh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's pals up. Hello, you're through to the lip. Hello, this is the LCPD. Where would you like us to send an officer? Actor. An LCPD peacekeeper will be there as soon as possible, sir. LCPD, what's the problem? Bunch of idiots. Don't try to be a tough guy. Please, no! I'm close to I've got you in my sights! One more move and you're a dead man!
calculating route. Please make a U-turn where safe. In 200 yards. Hey, Derek. Apparently, your guy hangs out at the burger shop in the Alderley. Go check it out. Make sure his boys are there. I want them all to pay. What if he's alone? Keep the police call. He'll see you and think you're taking him down. First thing Bucky will do is run back to his crew. Fucking coward! Would rather everyone go down than him take a ball alone. Told me out, didn't he? I guess he did, man. I'll tell you when it's done. Run to your friends, Bucky. The cops are here. I got a little I told you not to fuck with me!
Nico! Nico, my boy. Good to hear your voice. To speak to you, I mean. Derek, you okay? Bucky and this boys are dead. What? Sorry, not off for a second. Bucky dead? <laughs> Good. Yeah, alive. But dead. It's all the same though, isn't it? Living, dead, good, bad, right, wrong, chalk, shit. I'll speak to you when you're back among the living. Looky here, another shit. Pull over! Where to? So can you take... This is as far as I can go, okay? Can I have one of them, please? Just so you know, I'm not live, but enjoy! Thank you. Almost no face meat, guaranteed! Are you trying to get us both killed, you fucking asshole? What? I send you to destroy an organization and you only make the boss disappear. Now his chief lieutenant is holed up in an apartment and he wants to speak to the feds. Whoa, hold on. An organization? No, you fucking idiot! I paid you to do a man's job, you amateur, you fucking boy! No, 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 no. You sent me to kill one guy. One guy who would put you in prison. Bullshit! <sighs> All right, I'll tell you what, genius. I'll tell you fucking. Tell it to the judge. Tell him I only sent you to kill one guy, so it ain't your fault. <laughs> I wonder what he'll say. Maybe he'll let you walk, on account of you being brain dead and totally fucking <laughs> mentally retarded. Maybe he will. Either way, you're screwed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait. <laughs> Look, you gotta do this for me. For us. Come on, you idiot. One more. The guy's a fucking low life. He means nothing. If there is a god, and he loves us, if there is, he'd want this cut dead. The guy sells heroin to kids. The world is full of bad people. But we've got a lot to lose. I don't have anything to lose, Mr. McCreary. <sighs> How much? You know my price. No. Five. You're cool. I don't care. You bastard. Okay. Now the guy lives in an apartment on Denver between V and W. He's holed up there pretty tight. I left a rifle for you in the trunk of a car at the corner of Albany and M. So go there, give me a call. So, we need... Let's do it. That's great. Calculating root. the name of the peasant woman who stole my first child. L200 yards. Turn left.
found the place. Okay, the mopes hold up in his apartment. It's on the fourth floor on the east side of the street. Go up onto the roof of the building opposite to get a shot at him. What if he isn't standing by the window? Then use your damn imagination to get him to the window. Jesus! Call me when it's done. Hijo of puta, I'll break your fucking kneecaps. I'm telling you now, I'm one sick motherfucker! Stop. The left side of my face has gone numb. Who are you calling for Burger Shot? The Heart Stopper. The all new Tower of a Meal at Burger Shot. It's the six pound. I dealt with him. You did the right thing. I hope that the kids out there get this message and realize that there are better paths to take. I'm not interested in your sermon, Mr. McCreary. Let's not pretend that this was anything other than business. There's nothing wrong with admitting that you've done some 